Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to my craft room temporarily. <laughs> and you're probably wondering where in the world is she gone now because I've been missing in action for a few days. Well, here's the story. We're getting ready to move. And actually we've been out looking at places and found a lovely brand spanking new apartment community that's basically 55 and older. It's only 6.9 miles from here. So it's an easy commute back and forth for right now. Um, the issue is that we wanted to get settled in our own place and give the kids the opportunity to do whatever they need to do in this house to get it ready to sell. And Chelsea is going to help us uh, talk today. <laughs> She's wandering around. Um, it is, uh, it, the house is beautiful and there's not a lot that needs to be done. But, you know, look at this, a craft room, um, I, and our bedroom and our bathroom are all upstairs. And we will be on a single floor in our new place, which for Folks of our age is not all that bad, especially me with my two fake knees. Um, and it's going to be a brand new, as I said, so there'll be plenty of opportunities to do some decorating. And we'll share all of that with you. And this has happened very quickly. We've been looking at some of these communities around here for a while and found one that was brand new that we had never heard of. And we went over and looked at it and thought it was just perfect for us. And so we have applied. Now we're waiting for the application process to be approved. And, you know, you have to jump through hoops and all of that for, for that part to happen. But it should be approved by tomorrow. This is a Sunday when I'm recording this. And, of course, nothing gets done on the weekend. But uh, it should be approved by tomorrow, and if, in fact, it is, we plan to start moving in on Thursday of this coming week. I, I find this daunting over here. <laughs> Look at all of this stuff. It's got to go back in a bag again. But uh, other than the craft room, that's actually going to be the hardest room to, to um pack because there's more stuff in here than there is anywhere else. We don't have a stick of furniture except the bed we sleep in and that will go with us because we bought that when we got here. But uh, not a stick of furniture for the rest of the two bedroom with a dining area, living room, kitchen, whatever. So I've been having a good time with Amazon and Walmart. They're my best friends now, you know. And every day this package is arriving um, because it, not only just furniture, basically nothing. You know, I need a shower. Do you think a, like a wedding shower? Because we will be married in June 60 years. So I'm thinking every 60 years you should start over with new stuff. So uh, today, as of today, I have acquired a new set of Vavaware pans some new Corel dishes, some silverware, a toaster. There's a coffee pot being delivered today. And a new uh, um, bed spread puff comforter set for the bed. And in my Amazon standby cart, I guess you would say, I have dining room furniture. Um, let me see, dining room furniture, bar stools, towels. But I'm not going to order any of those because if they get delivered here, we'll only have to move them. So I'm just going to wait till we get there. Amazon doesn't take that long to deliver anyway. And so we'll have it delivered at the new place. So in the meantime, it's kind of difficult for me to be doing crafts because I'm going to be putting it all in a bag. <laughs> um, but I did want to let you know, and hopefully if we get the key on Thursday, which we expect to, I'll do an empty house tour and we'll see what we, we, we'll show everybody what the house looks like. These are, um, like apartment homes, 
that are attached to each other in a row. And they are a two-car garage, a two bedrooms, two bathrooms, a laundry area, a kitchen, living room. This particular model has a big room in the back that's a dining area. And it's going to be fun to decorate. So that's where I am. Oh my gosh, we're doing it again. And I hope to tell you, I don't expect to do it ever again. However, you never say never. <laughs> so anyway, and that's going to be fine for the kids. They'll get a chance to get this house all spiffed up. You know, they want to do some painting and, oh, I think they want to do some new countertops in the bathrooms and things like that. Just things that you normally would do when you're trying to get a house ready to sell. So we're excited. We're not looking forward to the packing, but I think it's going to be a fairly easy move because there's really no furniture to speak of except our bedroom furniture to move. So when I see you again, I will see you in my empty new home and we will start a new chapter again. And my second bedroom, by the way, will be set up as my craft room at an office. So I don't expect to put a bed in there right now. It's going to be all craft room and all office. And that's a pretty good size room with a pretty good size closet. So that'll be fun. So until I see you on Thursday, hopefully, maybe Friday, depending. I hope everybody has a great day. Stay safe. Say a prayer that we get all this stuff packed up. <laughs> <laughs> and over there again. And I will see you soon. Love you. Everybody play nice now. Bye-bye.